I'll go back to King's Quest, and we're and now we're going to get that trident for Neptune. Yay! King's Quest Two, sorry, yeah, we're back back to King's Quest Two. <laughs> <laughs> All right, oh, so boy. basically the water. Uh, uh, Theo might remember the desert from King's Quest Five. Yeah. Well, the 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 underwater explosion is kind of in that style. Yeah, exactly. Do, if you, if do, you don't do, know where you're going, no, basically no, no, you're no, 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 no. In, in, in this one, it's much simpler to get around. Trust <laughs> me. Like it's clear. much smaller. There's no. You cannot die of drowning because of the mermaid's kiss. So it's much more forgiving. Examining the heavily waterlogged remnants of the vessel, <laughs> you notice an old antique bottle. So what, could you like die of drowning in the, in the original? With great difficulty, uh, no. Over in your saddle. And Again, I haven't played any of these games. No, 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 no. Uh, just uh, anyway, any, we any, have any, it's okay. Just any bottle. question you have, just ask me, and I'll answer it. Okay. Um, from a wrecked vessel um, strewn in about the game, I mean. The <laughs> of the crew. You wonder if they were what color your underwear is. After they drowned. <laughs> because the remains of the crew, huh? I don't see any remains of the crew. I always see the remains of a ship. Maybe well, the remains of the crew I, are the I, sand. I, I, yeah, I suppose they are dead and gone for a long oh, time. Oh, so that's what a sharky is. Yes, that's what a sharky is. A shark with arms and muscle muscles. <laughs> so maybe so maybe the Titanic movie actually doesn't seem that far fetched. <laughs> no God, please no. Uh, uh well, this is far fetched the game, so doesn't really Alright, so yeah. basically what I'm what I'm doing right now is I'm looking for a specific oh there we go. This underwater realm belongs to the Sharkies. The water drops noticeably in temperature as you progress further into This is what happens when you press your eye icon on anywhere be underwater. There on patrol around here, part. so you remind yourself to be alert. There but of is course, of okay. You need to get closer. All right. Get closer to you me. I have to get closer. Stop so, trying uh, to scare me, Mister Narrator. No, notice, nothing can. Not, there is nothing. Notice how those luminescent fish are swimming over around and the pick grass. Some of the grass, which yeah, goes in that between means something. the rocks. So basically, and I need to to something to light uh, my path because there's you these stuff waters the are dark. You stuff the sugary grass so. into the empty bottle and push it all the way to the bottom. Pushing the sugary grass into, and now I use. You can't use oh, this. Actually, wait. There we go. Okay, now I'm commentating in the dark. Bottle on the seabed, close to the luminescent <laughs> fish. Okay, so since the fish love this this grass so much, I'm using the grass in the bottle to attract them. Let's see. Hey, yeah, look. A few of the glowing <laughs> fish are now swimming around inside the bottle. All right, now I got myself a light source. Yay! A bottle. You take the bottle. Oh, and I love what you can do with Bot the bottle here. Donk. <laughs> Donk. 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 Hardy har har. Donk, 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 donk. You can't donk. use this. Oh. Uh -huh. uh, I, can, I can imagine. It's interesting because, uh, I mean, uh, when you make a King's, when they make a King's Quest game, they have to think about every single possible reply the narrator gives to anything you might try. So I when even the, called the, when the donks were being said. So, 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 so <laughs> when the... So when the... Um, when they probably, probably when they thought, mm, what what should we do if he tr if the player tries to use the bottle on himself? This uh, is the donk. main entrance to the Sharky's <laughs> fortress. <laughs> Judging mm. by the looks of things, simply entering and grabbing the trident will not be as easy as you'd hope. Yeah, totally. You, get the definitely. you should not dally here for any length of time. Truly, they don't look friendly at all. So, nope. Yeah. Uh, what we need is some chum. Okay, so let's try to um, go around it. See what we find. So yeah, there's a lot. There, there's a lot of exploration involved in these games. Just look. I wonder, yeah. are these sharks part of the Sharky tribe as well? Oh no, no, no. Those normal sharks are just sharks, and uh, they can't they can't see for shit, so they're not that dangerous. Yeah. Let me guess. The Sharkies are smarter. Yeah, the Sharkies are smart. Basically, they're more evolved sharks, I guess. So when Samuel L. Jackson going to um appear only to be eaten? Poor, poor bastard. <laughs> Okay, Dwib, since you bring it up so much, what did you think of that movie? Um, I haven't seen that movie. All I've seen is that it appears um, part. to be another part of the rock. Wow. Hold on, notice that this fish. Under... Oh, notice that fish right there. You can't be sure, but there seems to be something odd about this fish's swimming patterns. Look at uh, that fish. Okay. okay. Uh, did that fish just go into the wall and 
get... Oh, that that's just clipping. <laughs> no, 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 actually, it's <laughs> or not clipping. maybe clip. it's a ghost fish. It's actually not clipping, as you're... I know, I know, I know, but, Having you know, the fish you use these days out of the rock wall. justifies you that. You will be subtle and tell that. That's the way we programmed it. Passes right hang, through. On. hang on, Jova, big deep blue sea Having isn't the form I reference a lot. That's Blade Trinity. Huh? You said that you said I talk about the film a lot. Illusion. I don't I don't you talk about big pass through deep blue sea a lot, do I? Caves and I was talking about during side. this commentary since you brought up the Samuel Jackson thing. Okay, mm, so that's the first time I've said it, but whatever. So this tunnel is very dark, so, which is why I went to I went out on my way to get that luminescent fish in the bottle so that I had a way to light my path. I wonder if there's any sharkies in this tunnel. Can uh, those um, cursed magicians um, appear in this? Fortunately, there uh, is no. Yeah, fortunately. No. That would be jive if they did. They can swim. <laughs> don't worry. We'll, would... Don't worry. We'll have a, a little confrontation with the sharkies in a moment. <laughs> Let me guess. The narrator will tell you sharkies are here. Well, look at that. We found ourselves a giant seashell. Yay. I'm gonna try and collect it and add it to my seashell collection. Oh wait, no, it's heavy as shit. All right, let's move closer. There we go. Okay, so basically this this. So you had to move closer. You had to go you down back there anyway. Small basically the this thing. Basically this thing might. is blocking our path, so we need to use our uh, sword to try to. And you realize that combat will not be an option. Yeah. So if it ever comes to that, you are in big trouble. Yep. You don't say. There we go. As you open the door, ample light floods into the underwater cave, and you are now able to make your way around without the glowing fish. Thankfully. All right. Be so free, glowing fish. Be free, assuming we let you go. Okay, so a little moment to save, and let's go. I will never let you go. You are ours forever. Wahahaha. <laughs> hey, look, it's the Sharky You're King. You're an ass. The Sharky King. He does indeed have the triangle. Oh. Oh no, the seahorse he has looks... followed you. Let's hope it doesn't give your presence away. Uh, you he's here! concealed behind the remnants of a stone archway. This is fortunate, as the king of the Sharkies is also <laughs> here. Aside from his menacing appearance, he also seems to be in a very bad mood. Great! Oh, you don't totally what we needed! Whoa! Work for me. Is it not written the Trident's power can only be wielded by those of goodwill? Yeah, good will. Because you're totally a good guy. The king's aides nod fervently. <laughs> and do I not possess the greatest will in this kingdom? The goodest no one looking can for. In battle. <laughs> Wanna bet? Is unshakable. No amount of bleeding can dissuade me from slaughtering my enemies. Does yeah, really, that sounds like good will. See? <laughs> Love is the logic. Sharky King's aides seem all too well. <laughs> then why does it not work? <laughs> Cause you suck. You watch carefully as the Sharky King taps four shells in order around the arc. Puzzle. Welcome to our Professor Layton commentary. <laughs> <laughs> Underwater. So. So yeah, you were supposed to pay attention there, so you can do the combination yourself. Simple. So we're watching um, Thunderball. Have you seen Thunderball, Pedro? I have. Territory. For without the trident's power, Would you think it'd be more exciting if Bond were fighting the people? I've seen pretty much all of Bond movies. Yeah, yeah, all, all of them actually, yeah. All of them. Um, hold on. Why does this guy say that without the trident's power? I mean, it's not like they would even use it As because leaves, apparently the they're all no, 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 Look, look, uh, look it's, it's, it's the usual thing. Like, he's greedy for power, so he, fought, he stole the trident so he could, you know, do magic shit and whatever. Oh, I get that, I get that. But what's his logic that, like, well, like, well, they'll be defenseless Having without idea, the trident, even though because they the probably would be be, be, Because the, we, we established in the last part, Joe, but that the Mer people are very pacifist and don't really like violence. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. That's what I'm saying. It's like, well, wouldn't that suggest that they wouldn't Look have even used go. it to defend the themselves if they were that passive? Well, to be well, sure. well, if they're in fear of death, I'm sure they will do it, you know. Like, huh. it, it's one thing to be a pacifist, it's one thing to just outright not defend yourself and let yourself be killed. <laughs> like, yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Monty Mate. Python? Alright, so... You oh, that Monty Python sketch is just so easy to watch. Yeah. yeah. 
I wonder if there'll be a jump scare. I, uh, I I actually, if I remember correctly, I I I screwed up here, so I'm gonna restore my my save file. If I remember correctly. Yeah. Wait, 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 wait. wait. So something bad happens if you don't press don't the don't wrong worry order. don't 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 worry about it. I skip everything now. <laughs> oh, I get that page, but what happens if you get this wrong? Oh, no. If I get this wrong, I won't be able to get the trident. Uh, I I can just well well it's the thing like. If you, you can't get the, if you can't get the puzzle right, you can still use the skip button you saw there, so I can skip the puzzle part and just get yeah. the trident automatically. <laughs> However, if I do skip and not do the puzzle correctly, I, I miss some points. Oh, okay. what's that? Forty out of one hundred eighty-five. Uh, that's the po that's the score. Like, um, yeah. if if I, if I reach full points, that means I completed the game in the best possible way by solving everything in the most. Uh, Thoughtful way, Having basically. An idea. Basically, there's yeah. basically every single obstacle in puzzle in a King's Quest game has various ways to overcome it. The most thoughtful approach, the less, Look the least thoughtful approach, and the most thoughtful approach usually gets you the more points. Basically, the, basically the score, basically the score is a way of, uh, of you knowing exactly, uh, like, uh, like it was their way of telling you, okay, have I done everything that is to do in this game? You push on the shell. It okay, so this time I actually get it right. There we go. See, I wanna. You notice I want a point because of it. Yeah. <laughs> By the way, uh, Teo, I'm sure you'll notice how this frame right here is taken straight from King's Quest V. Without yeah. delay, the, you yeah, snatch yeah, exactly. up the before the guards well, return not, to their posts. I, no, I totally not blame this. Uh. It appears as if the guards are losing interest in the seahorse. Oh shit! You'd better get out of here quickly. Indeed. Yep. Yeah. So, and go, flee. Well, so much for that climatic battle with the Actually, sharky. Joe, actually, Joe, we're gonna have ourselves a race. Oh no, the seahorse has followed you all the way back to the oh, sea. Oh my god, this seahorse is sure retarded. To you. <laughs> <laughs> You're screwed. Alright, let's save quickly. And... Da, 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 there we go. Okay, so now uh, uh, you remount the seahorse. Okay, so here's another example of the um, the ways I can go through this. Okay, so now we have a small Your seahorse That's glides right. onward, flicking its little tail faster than ever. You grip the reins tightly. I wonder, is there ever a point in a King's so Quest game where you actually outright centuries. fight something? You make there is in King's Quest Six, the climax melts into relief. Yeah. Nice. It is to be short -lived. Even I mean the King's Quest Five final boss kinda. Short arcade sequence? Yeah, basically oh, you, you can actually choose to play through it. <laughs> yeah, basically it's the it's, I can skip this part this particular arcade game uh, arcade minigame, but if I do I'll miss on some points. So yeah. let's do let's go through it. So this is this is a really this is really easy anyway. It's just a matter of uh paying attention. Time. To the arrows, D dodging shit. I also, I, ha I also have to keep pressing down on the key. Basically, you play this with the the, the arrow keys on your keyboard, and uh, mm -hmm. you have you have to you have to keep pressing down so you can keep going faster. Otherwise, the shark keys will catch you. Yeah. And if you get hit by rocks, obviously you slow down. And uh, as you can see, the shark keys are getting closer, so it's not a good idea to fuck up to, uh, too often. <laughs> Oh, oh god. No. Oh no. Sorry, the longer I look at it, the more obvious that it's just th th using the same, like, three pictures Finally, you in see a loop. the light at the end of the tunnel. You quickly Te make a dash for the Technology exit. Technology limitation. I guess that's it! Okay, there we go. Huh. No confrontation with the king? As you emerge, you realize you have no, no, we, seconds uh, before Jova, the we don't, we, come out as, as the narrator very, very well put it, could, combat is not an option sure here. The commotion would attract the sentry's attention. <laughs> then you try to fight, hey, hey Jova, try to fight a shark underwater Suddenly, with your bare hands. See how that turns out. Voice in your head. Well, I would bring up some of the Jaws movies, but then again... The Jaws no, movies? We're... Seriously, Jova, you're using the fucking well, Jaws well, movies? Well, Pedro, there's actually a... a there's actually the technique you of, uh, you know, bl uh, blinding them because their eyes are very weak. Indeed. Okay, so... Uh, that's, 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 uh, we are using a trident, after all. So, use, by using the magic of the trident, I turned the oh. wall into a real wall, so now they can get out. Oh. Sucks <laughs> <laughs> to be them. Okay, so now that we're done... So, the, so the sharks are trapped. Now that I have the trident yeah. with me, I can actually turn the sharkies... I can actually fight the sharkies with, with it, as I'm about to show up, to show off. 
I think. Oh, so we can fight them. See? Now I can. No, uh, but that's because I have a magical trident, Jova. There you that's go. That's what I was thinking. See? That, that's the one. See, that's what happens, Jova, if you try to fight you the sharpies. You have the means to protect yourself. Use the trident. Well, I kind of wanted to show off the, the death, so. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I mean, also, how the narrator outright tells you what you did. So let me get yeah. straight. You thought that you've all people. Oh, it's, all, oh, 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 it's, all, it's always like that. It's always like that. Because every, the narrator, all, the best, some of, one of the best, one of the best things about King's Quest is the death messages. The narrator always has yeah. great jokes for it. Definitely. <laughs> Turn him into stone or something. Like there, there's oh, one, uh, there's one uh, that I, there's one that I love. Um, in uh, in King, in, in oh, actually wait. Let me think of. Okay, uh, there's one you that, I, that use there's one that I love in King's Quest Five where if you, you much if you walk in the desert you too much you die at first the shark. And, and, the, and then the narrators are like dying for what? a drink, Graham. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, as I was anyway as I was saying though, um, there I do know one you place I do know another place where you can actually fight off a shark with your bare hands. In Arkham City. Well, but that was because it was Batman, you know. That's a different story. But, but, but that can be explained by two simple words, Jova. I'm Batman. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that said, though, I mean, that said, though, when I mentioned fighting them, I was sort of thinking, like, with a trident, since you had it. Mm -hmm. I have the... When Pedro said, I'm Batman, I had the urge to make that Frank Miller quote joke thingy, but I'm not going to. <laughs> Good. <laughs> It's going to because be that's not Batman. What are you? It's going to be what are interesting. You get are you retarded or something? Be... Who the hell do you it's think gonna... I am? I'm the goddamn <laughs> Batman. So Pedro did it for me anyway. Thank you. It's going to be well, quite interesting. Well, uh, 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 honestly, you honestly, you, Terry, you have to admit, to that line is kind of hilariously stupid. And then yeah. Frank Miller... It doesn't, it doesn't, it doesn't it. really make it better, though. I know, I know, but it's still kind of hilarious. <laughs> anyway, as I was about to say, though, it's going to be interesting when we get to our Let's Read of that comic. Oh, but definitely. We've got, but we've got other Frank Miller he stuff to do. What about the RoboCop sequels or the Sin it. City films? I, Dwibs, I said a let's read. Commemorate the Should we do anyway. the other Frank Miller stuff? Uh, why n success. well, of course, yeah, I but we can also do that. For a yeah, sure. Again, All right, so All-Star Batman is comedic gold. All right, guys, time to celebrate. You eat, except drink, since we do, since, uh, 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 except because of technological people, limitations, we can only uh, show a black screen and skip straight to after the party. So, chance to speak yeah. with Neptune alone. Hmm. So, is this the last we'll ever see of the, the King of the of Sharkies? Yes. The three uh, stages of alas. Water gives birth to life. Ah, uh, poor king. What I have given you is the first of three. Second is the growth gem. Yeah, no, no, we need the seventh of eight. We need to go here to get that, to get that, to go here to get that. <laughs> How might I find the growth gem? So yeah, the next is the air gem or growth gem. Its location is as far above the surface of the land as no we shit. are. You know, know actually, watching Beyond this game that, in the dark I is actually quite atmospheric. You. Wait, so you're telling me that this gem is in the land of Bioshock Infinite? Because uh, that one takes exactly the sky. Sure, why not? Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, total good. Just wait till it's night time. Uh, when it's night time, the, the game does a really great job in creating a scary atmosphere. Where? Underwater or no, 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 um, inland, I mean. Yeah. That reminds me, does this one like on a real time clock or something? No, or does it move the story? Uh, no, 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 Joe, but that's the next game. In the next game in King's Quest 3, we are under a clock. As for that gem's look, but in and this one, it's I story. As Taya would confirm. No yeah. To the castle. I was afraid these games are on Steam. Uh, no, 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 these games are free. Uh, yeah, but there's, there's a collection. Don't, 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 like, if you are going to get the King's Quest collection from Steam, do be sure to tell me so I can give you a, pa a specific fan oh, patch that corrects the problems. Because the, the King, because the official Activision collection is horrible. Because Activision, god dang it. Are these games on GOG? My, my, my recommendation, Dwibs, is go, uh, they're also on GOG, yes, and GOG is the definite way to get them. Uh, but uh, as for King's Quest 1 through 3, I recommend instead you, you go to agdi.com and, and get these free remakes, because these are the definitive ways of playing the first free games.
and everything else after those? After those, you you can go to gum, ga good old game dot com and head back towards the or Gog, source. as Strips put it. What an incredible Even experience! King's Quest Eight. You are certain you will never forget yes, the adventure you just it. had. Additionally, <laughs> you have acquired one of the gyms. I can't wait till we get to where our squirm plays King's Quest Eight. I hate subsided. that game so much. And since it's on a PS4, um, and wait. I don't quite have a PS4. Wait, no, King's Jova, Quest. That's not Queen's, King's Quest Eight. Oh wait, wait, so. sure, 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 sure. Sorry, 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 sorry. I was thinking about King's Quest Fifteen. You mean the new one? Yeah, the yeah. reboot. Yeah, it's, the reboot. I heard yeah, that it's, it's a reboot. Well, no, no, oh. it's a reboot. I'll yep, be, I'll be, I'll, I'll have... will, I will give it a chance, but I will, but I, but of course, but it looks like a giant betrayal. But uh, wait, okay. wait, 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 wait. Hold on, wait, wait. Let me get this straight. It's a reboot, yet they're still listing it as a numbered sequel. No, Gee, not. Where no, 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 Jova, it's not this as a numbered sequel, but the complete title is King's Quest 2 points, the, the closest your legacy thing, awaits. The closest thing we ever really, got I to... I thought it was called the King's Quest, you know, the insert number here. No, it's not. No. Okay, the, the closest thing we have to a King's Quest 9 is a, a fan-made game called The Silver Lining. It was originally called King's Quest 9, but Activision uh, asked them to change the name, so they changed it to The Silver Lining. Anyway, here. Huh. This might help your sneezing. Yeah. Oh. Thanks. We did all that to help a haystack, or and, whoever's in the haystack. Well, we did get the 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 water gem. That's progress. Here, you can have this back now. Yeah, but seriously, we risked our lives <laughs> against man eaters just to get help him get a claw. Feel better? <laughs> yeah. It's so good to be able to. Oh, oh boy. No, don't you dare! <laughs> oh, hey, look, it, it, hey, look, a silver needle. It needs something. Get oh, it? Needle, oh, a haystack. The silver a silver needle. needle in a haystack. Who would have known? <laughs> you take I a silver needle. You got, you uh, got a murder. silver needle! Oh. Indeed. So what are you going to do? Po stop the librarian? The All right, the there, there, there you go. There <laughs> you, you wish. Go. There you go, Divs. There's the link. Uh, this is what you should do. They're, they're completely... Fr uh, go to the AGDI's website. You, you can get all three King's Quest games in the definitive remakes yes. with full-blown voice acting and all that shit. Completely book? free. So basically, this woman is the only member left alive of this club. There! <laughs> Pretty much. I'll put it under me favorites in case I this want to play it sometime. Entitled sure, sure. Legends. Legends. Browsing through it, you notice an interesting excerpt. Is there a league of these All right, legends? Th th this, is, oh, uh, this, this is actually lore. Uh, so oh, I'll go no, read it. first king known as the Legion Menor is is as much an enigma as history as he is woven from the fabric of legend itself. Brewer's passing occurred 1,000 years ago. It remained something unclear as to, as to the manner of his death and what became of the power he wielded. Historians do know that Leginamore was a powerful magician, or a wizard, as he might be called nowadays. He is largely credited with bringing along of his kind magic and civility to Daventry and the Keep surrounding in mind, world. Keep uh, you don't, you are not forced to read this. Yeah, it, it's just a little lore for those who are willing to delve a little deeper into the lore of the of the world of the world of the game. And unlike, stuff. That other, unlike that other game that you don't like. Well, you don't like it either, so I haven't played it. Well, the point is, uh, this actually ties. Uh, this is not just lore, though, because this actually does tie into the plot. Because this actually ties into the motivation of the villain who's orchestrating all that's going on. So, uh, basically, th a long time ago, Lugenimor, the Draventry's first king, was a very powerful wizard who had an immensible power. But he hid his power. Um, in, in this, basically, he made himself mortal um, and hid his power somewhere. And uh, from what uh, from legend says that apparently his crown is the key to his power, but we still. I but... love how we're focusing on a wizard when really the main plot of this game, you know, at first was to just get a bride. We go on some of the darndest side adventures, don't we? Well, the, well, the, the, as you uh, trust me, Jova. When we do eventually meet the vil the big villain of this game, it this actually ties in into his motivation stuff. So. There's a reason for this. It's not just. I lore. know, I know, I know. It's it's kind of cool how you know <laughs> you this sort of got mixed up. It's like, well, you, when you think about it, it's almost fate. 
even though his main purpose, well, you know, his main goal was to get a bride doing all this, he's apparently, it sounds like he's going to help a lot more people than expected. One thing you'll Not appreciate, like, well, but for example, there's one thing, one thing you'll appreciate, Wibs, is that the first game, that's right there from the side I, I, I linked you, uh, the first game has a special, you can either play it in the original uh, mode for, for purists, or you can turn on a special mode for beginners where it's impossible to get stuck and run into a dead end, so you can just play uh, fine and so it's it's very newbie friendly. Okay. Yes. Could you Don't you just love those synthesized book? trumpets? <laughs> <laughs> I think for a fan, I, honestly for a fan made game, I find this. Uh, yeah, this is impressive. This book is entitled Power. Nah, Power I've heard that and fan remakes, but it's Browsing still pretty charming. No, but, but, but keep in mind, Joe, but this uh, this remake originally came Whoa. out. Oh. Ah, oh, Jesus Christ! Keep in mind, Jova, this this remake originally came out in two thousand two, back when fan made games were like a novelty. I mean, this was like, this was like back when. Uh, imagine, I mean, yeah, nowadays. Back when only a handful of people used the internet around the world. Yeah, like this. This was like when this first came out in two thousand two. It completely blew everybody who was actually able to download it away because you know it, it had it has so much polish and you know work put into it. Like, okay, I'll give you that for its time. It's definitely impressive. Not to mention, this is this was using the King's Quest V engine, so this is specifically meant to sound like a game that was made in the early 90s. So it, it fits. Of course. It, it, kind of like Mega Man 9 or um, Shovel Knight. Like it's, it, it's, it, it, it's oh supposed, yeah, Mega Man 9. It's supposed to feel like an old game. So. You have nothing else. You have, n you have nothing to say at the moment. So let's get out. How rude. <laughs> All right, so what's the... Hey, now let's... Um, earlier I couldn't enter into this store, but now I can. So let's see what's in here. Huh. Oh. Um, okay. Good afternoon. Ah. What can I do for you, <laughs> dear? Hello. Uh. Do you sell anything that would aid an ascent up a mountain? Unfortunately, I do not sell climbing equipment or anything of that sort. This is really a specialist store. Oh. Uh... However, I do have an item which you might find useful. This lamp. The lamp. Is said oh, to a lamp. Contain a genie. Oh boy. Oh boy. Uh, myself, we're getting the Aladdin round. Uh... Actually, 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 the Nature game makes you think it's going to add route, but it actually brings you another way, another route. It's uh, also uh, funny, please, because the they do this kind of again, King's Quest Five, even though it's much more deadly. You, you hope it is not. Let me guess. Uh, in this one, well, the genie is actually just some person called Genie. No. You are a man who no. seems adept at oh. taking care of himself. Perhaps you could do a small favor for me? Oh boy. Somehow I'm an NPC! You knew you she was right. <laughs> 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 beautiful nightingale. Why brown round? But the sentimental value far outweighs its monetary worth. That foul old witch Hagatha stole it from me. Probably to use in some concoction no, or thank you. Welcome to King's Quest the Musical. Oh nice! So, if you could be a sweetie and retrieve it for me, <laughs> I will trade you the lamp for the bird. Uh, I can give you a bird right now, well, but you will not like I, it. I love how <laughs> grand. I love yeah, it. There's you your bird. Careful. I'll give you the lamp. I love how grand size. Like I love how self-aware the game is about the whole fetch quest thing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. See you in the next part, everybody. See ya. Uh, see ya.